Hi everyone, so right now uh, this is your guy from Z Technology and I'm going to show you on how to uh, configure free internet settings so that you can be able to use the internet for free using a, uh, you have to have a Zamtel data sim card so the first step is uh, let me just show you uh, that my balance is zero that I don't have uh, any bundles let me just show you my Zamtel sim card is in uh, sim 2 So as you can see, my balance is zero. Then I'll just show you on the bundles. Okay, let me just uh, read out. I made a mistake. Okay, then I'll go on option five. As you can see, my data balance uh, is zero. Then after I've uh, checked this, let me just uh, show you that uh, my SIM2 is Zamtel. Uh, then the first step uh, you have to do, you have to go to your settings. That is mobile network settings, the APN. Then you have to, uh, when you enter in your settings, you just have to uh, type in on the name. You have to put Zamtel. On the APN, you have to type in zamtel.net in small letters. Then save the settings. Then after you save the settings, you have to now download this application known as Anonitan. After downloading this application, you have to download another application which is known as HTTP Injector. Then after you download both of the applications, you have to now go to your settings. Let me just reset this. Then after you go in the applications, you see why it's written stealth settings. Then once you go there, you have to uh, switch on the stealth tunnel on or, on or off uh, feature. Then you have to enter HTTP on the connection portal. Then on the connection port, you have to enter AET and uh, you have to go down where it's written custom TCP or HTTP headers. Then after you do that, uh, press down edit. Then while you have seen where I've written uh, uh, m.facebook.com, you have to uh, remove everything. Then type in apps.zamtel.co dot uh, zm slash uh, balance slash uh, redirect then dot uh, php so that's what you have to type in that's uh, apps dot zamtel dot co dot zm slash balance slash redirects dot php then uh on the connection here you just have to go where it says connect then on the injection mode no more then you have to uh to enable this but the black query you have to leave it out then you have to go and save then after you save the settings, again, you have to go and save. Yes. Then after you save them, you have to turn on the data, your data. So you've seen I've turned on my data. Then you have to go and connect. So it's still connecting right now. still connecting okay it's right in connection field let me try to connect again